So this is the interior of the spectroscope. Um, light enters in from this side over here. There's a small slit that it travels through. The beam of light will hit a mirror here, bounce off a diffraction grating, and then come out this side, which is where the camera will go. So I'm going to just plop the top back on. And when we take our camera in through this side here, we should be able to see the solar spectrum. And there it is. So this is the solar spectrum. I'm panning across from the red to the blue end of the spectrum. This is a fairly high resolution spectroscope, so we can't see the entire spectrum all at once. All those vertical dark lines are absorption lines where light from the core of the sun is being absorbed by cooler gases in the outer atmosphere. Uh, the darker lines, more prominent lines, are usually caused by hydrogen in the sun's atmosphere because there's lots of hydrogen inside the sun. Now, what this uh, shows us kind of more or less why the sun produces these absorption lines. Light is uh, produced in the core of the sun where nuclear fusion is occurring. And as that light passes through the cooler outer layers of the sun, some of that light gets absorbed uh, before it, it makes its way to Earth. Uh, 